Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Lini D and you're watching Lini D. Before getting started, hope you guys can subscribe to the channel and like the video. And if you want any other tutorials, just comment it down below. So today we're gonna talk about many VTuber apps in mobile for Android. Um, my phone is an Android, so yeah. Anyways, there's a lot of applications that VTubers can use. You can just find it in the Google Play. Um, so, first one, if you want to be a VTuber, but you want to just like play around with friends, like as I did one day. Um, if you guys watch the video, I mean, I've deleted, I don't know, I just... I meet here a lot of uh, friends that they are like they are not vtubers they don't have a youtube channel but they have this vr or um this thing like very good avatar or model so what are you gonna do if you have a very good hub model or very good um avatar you're just gonna install this application and play with it if you want to know how, just comment it down below and I'll do a tutorial. The second application, it's the same one, but I'm not sure if you can to use your avatar, like the Verwood avatar. There's just some VTubers. There's this one too. All of these are just some games you can play, like a VR chat but in mobile. one it's a 2d model um, which is very cool actually I like it um, the face tracking is very very good and I really really like it smooth movement amazing cute design and all that it's like a demo of the VTube studio you know and V frame this V frame, I've tried it actually. It just, um, it is too slow and it's running too slow. I think it's just because of my phone. And you can do the face tracking with the 3D model if you have a very weird model. And you can just, uh, as they said about this application. So, if you want to do like, the 3D model replacement, just do this. Place one VRM file and the following file path on the terminal. Slash Android slash data slash com com dot monaca dot reframe slash files slash v frame. This is what you're gonna do and you're gonna play replace your model, your file VRM file and there there's the very mobile which is the um, the application that you you should actually have if you want to use these applications it's the first thing that you need the first thing to customize your avatar or your own model there is this CV VTuber example it is very cool actually I've try it it is very cool there's some um some models that you can use uh, the face tracking is very good and yeah i really like it you if you want to record this you're just gonna need a record screen and yeah bam you're a vtuber right now there's this too that have the kizuna model um I'm not sure that there is the face tracking thing. You can just move it, I guess. Um, there is this thing too. I just cannot read Kanatana. I guess it's called Kanatana. I don't know. Um, it is just like lips sync or <laughs> I don't know. Which is, um, they use the Kizuna eye model to here. I love Kizuna. 
And here's Miku, our camera. Miku tour, I guess. Miku tour. Yeah, anyways. Um, there's this model of Miku um, in the world. You can just use um, your uh, camera. There's a lot of applications like this one. Um, there's this one too. Camera, cam, real, AR avatar camera. Hmm. It is very cool too. I mean, you can use any of these applications that you see. It's good for you. There's this one too. 3D, um, make avatar. It's 3D too, but it's like the, um, the options of uh, customizing it's limited are limited so you cannot customize as you want it someone actually tried this application before and they said that you can be a 2d vtuber with this um you can select your model 2d model that you're gonna find in the workshop of this application i've tried this but i've installed it and i cannot reinstall it because i don't know that you have some problems in this application so you can just install it once um you can just download a model in the workshop then it's gonna be like this and all you're gonna do is this 2D model or 2D avatar. It's gonna be on your screen while you're playing something or doing a tutorial. Just record screen your phone. This is all what you're gonna need to do. Yeah, guys, so that was the video. Hope you guys like it. Hope you guys gonna like this video and subscribe if you want any other tutorials and if you want me to see, to tell you how to use all of these applications and to try it, just comment it down below and don't forget to press the bell icon there. You see it? Just press it there and you're gonna get a notification every single time I post a video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Bye.